Hello and welcome to the third part of the Randox Accusero 24-7 training series. In this part we're going to look at the navigation elements, that is using the sidebars that are found um, in the Accusero 24-7 platform. We've already mentioned before but we'll start again with the platforms icon at the top. So if we want to go to any other QC software platforms that we have a subscription, simply click on this button at the top. We have our RICUS, our Verify, our RQC, and our RICUS POC. At the very top, it'll tell you the page that you're on. So we're currently on the home page. However, if we want to go to a different page, we simply hover over each icon and it will tell us where we are. So on the left hand side, we first have configuration. Within configuration, we have our instrument configuration, assay configuration, stats comparison, performance limit and so on. Below that we have our custom, our addition of custom. So this is where we could add custom analytes, methods, lots, units, temperatures, instruments, reagent suppliers, custom mapping, uh, total liable error limits and stats comparisons. Then we have our reports, our importing methods, our QC review, our help section, including the user guide, which is available for download, and our user section. Our user section then is uh, tells us at the top our current username ID. And on the right hand side, we have our utility section with advisor, change control set, change instrument, the schedule of fixed cumulative mean, and copy targets. We then have our chart section our data entry section, and our current selection of tests. As stated before, if we select some tests, these will be displayed on the current selection icon. That does it for the navigating sidebars part um, of the Accusator 24-7 training series. Uh, if you join us again, we'll be looking at the result history screen next.